but six miles out of Sturgis. So. just right up on the side of the hill like they put every other name up through here we don't have hills in Florida they got it here all right very good well that's it we've seen Sturgis there's there might be more but that since since it's uh, uh, bike rally is not going on we don't know how far out they go yeah but I bet it's far yeah okay so this right here is what is this full throttle this is the full throttle saloon. compound mm -hmm. full throttle saloon and all of that there's still a few bikers out there i don't think there's look at the look at the uh yeah sculptures out here super cool yeah oh i guess they only have one gate open Carrie, this is super cool i did not know it was I really thought it was all going to be temporary looking. Yeah. All right, we'll go back through it. Oh, look at here. Oh, I'm looking. Oh, man. Hey. <coughs> Pardon me. Wow. So you can park and they will escort you down to I the party. Guess, I guess. Uh -huh. And you got your sewer dock for your RV? Yeah, they got a bunch of them there. They got some gasoline. Good grief. Right. They're not playing. Alright, this is the Buffalo Chip. All right, we're coming back into the valley. Uh, we were here earlier, but we're going to find something for lunch. But also, we're going to find Lead. Uh, Lead is another old west town, but I think they just kind of merged. But we're about to find out. All right. So this is still right now part of Deadwood, mm -hmm. but it's off of that main historical, and we're about to turn on the Sherman here and head out of town and into lead.
this is so cute. Look. Uh-huh. Now this is downtown Lee. This is their historic district. Basically, one side says, Welcome to Lead, and the other side says, Deadwood. Entertaining guests since 1876. They didn't entertain old Wild Bill too well, did they? Okay, this is, what's the name of this place? Belfort. Belfort. In 800 feet, turn right. It's in. This, this is not it. One more time. All right, one more tenth. Anyway, what we're looking for, we're in South Dakota, right outside of Spearfish, and we're turning here. Take the second right, then your destination will be on the left. To the Center of the Nation Museum and Monument, and Visitor Center, and all that good stuff. And we're going to get out your and go see the Center of the Nation. Oh, they have a sweet corn festival. They sure do. All right. All right, we're parking right here. And we're going to go around and see the center of the nation monument. All right, so basically where we're at is a little community by the name of Bell Fort. And what happened was in 19... If I go up there, let me go out of the line. I'm just going to show us Hawaii over here to her left. Oh, you want to show me? Oh, right. All right. There you go. And so from Hawaii, you go that straight line up to Maine, to the far point in Maine. Mm -hmm. through that line and then you come down here to Key West which would be right here uh -huh. and you drew it up to Prudhoe Bay above Alaska up there and you would find that they intersect right where Linda's fixing to stand right there and Linda is now at exactly the geographic <laughs> center of the United States of America this is pretty cool. That's right. Pretty now, amazing. Now, down in Kansas, before Hawaii was brought in and Alaska was brought in, down in Kansas there was the, was the previous uh, geographic center. But right now, this little community in South Dakota is the geographic center of the United States of America. And I there it is. It. That's a pretty great uh, graphic representation, yeah. too. Because you think South Dakota is so far north, it couldn't possibly be. Uh -uh. But Alaska is sitting right where it belongs, because Canada obviously is in between. Yeah. And uh, so I think that is pretty cool. It's crazy, isn't it? Well, here we are. That's it. I love it. Been there. <laughs> here we okay. So, Lynn just made a good point. I am going to take this little camera. I'm going to stand right up here, put it straight up in the air, and you are now looking. This is what it looks like 360 degrees from the center of the United States of America. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, so here we have the we have the Hall of Flags because this is the geographic center of the United States. They have all the state flags here. Uh, so I'm going to look at or look. Oh, here it is, right here. Here's the Florida flag. So what I want to show you is no, I'm sorry. I don't even know the Florida flag. Apparently, let's see. Here it is. Oh, there it is. Duh. All right. What I want to show you about these are 
what is what to have florida it's called the sunshine state the motto is in god we trust capital is tallahassee and the driving distance from here 1801 miles so that's the driving to the closest part of the border right and then we got another 250 or 300 miles to get to home so we're about 2100 miles from home <laughs> but we have all the signal uh-huh plus canada isn't that crazy it's huh? pretty cool yeah all right